Lord, I need a break. Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome back to- Who is that? Who is that? Who are you? What was that? It's it, it's me, Will. No, we don't believe you. No, it's me, I swear. It's just I'm too scared to go to the barber. Boy, if you don't- get Black Santa cosplay? Mm -mm. Man, I'm up here bored. I look crazy. Lord be a Sudoku book. Lord be a barber. And Lord be a shield, because today we're gonna to look at some crazy stuff. You got the time, I got the time. Let's go ahead and get started. Incognito window. Yo, I need to get incognito window merch. Sometimes you just gotta be incognito when you search and stuff. YouTube.com. I don't think y'all ready for this. Extreme lice removal. Oh, can I, I never can spell it right. D-R-O-D-K. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. What is spell? Your breath stinks so bad. No. No. What are you doing? Girl, what is going on? I can't even read these things without feeling weird. The boom in lice removal? The to freedom! in lice removal? Okay, let's just get into this. I'm just gonna click the first one. Extreme head lice removal from Tiny Locks Lice Treatment Service. Oh my god. You know what? I'm done. This is these are living things. Lice isn't dandruff, you know what I mean? It looks like dandruff, which is why when I clicked on it, I was like kind of kind of okay. Okay as you can be when you're clicking on a lice video. <laughs> but knowing that this is something that's alive. I'm about to kill it. Ugh. I'm about to about to kill it. Ugh. Girl, why don't you have gloves on? Like, do you need gloves for this? I mean, she's spraying something on her hair. Um, I don't know what this is. I don't know what, what that is. But something tells me that you should use gloves for this. But maybe you don't. I don't know. Why was she bleeding? Baby's got what? Blood. Mm -mm, I'm emailing her right now. See, that's why you know you get lice and you got natural hair. You just you might as well cut your hair off. Throw the whole head away. You're done. I know y'all see that tiny lice comb. That joint got more teeth than Hillary Duff. I think she fixed it though. She fixed hers. So I'm guessing they spray something in your hair, it congeals, and then you take the lice comb and you scrape all of that stuff out, and it takes the lice with it. Oh. I'm. Done. Done. Mm. Kids be out here having a scalp bleeding, lice all over the place. I am so sorry to anybody who's ever had to go through this. This looks horrible. Oh my God. Look at it. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Now I see. What is that? The lice have legs? Y'all, I've really truly never like ever saw a lice. I don't even know what a lice is. Because rumor around the street when I was younger was, black people don't get lice. Who said that? Who said that? Who said that? But, but absolutely that stigma. This can like end up on anybody's head. But I do wonder if black hair care creates environments on your scalp that lice don't like. I don't like that. That maybe cause fewer cases in lice. I don't know. I'm not, a, I'm not an expert here. Oh my. That's a lot of lice. If that's not dandruff and that those are just little tiny things with little legs, that is scary. I couldn't imagine like looking at my scalp and then looking there and there's just like a bunch of little things crawling around. How could you let your kid get like this? I'm over here freaking out about a few. Oh, lice don't care if your hair is clean or dirty. They just want to feed off you. 
No. It's 50 cents a month, honey. If you want to live here, you got to pay rent. If I was a girl and had lice and loved my hair, I'd be like, shave me bald. Some girl in my class scratches it all over the dang floor and gave it to me. It's something on you. Look at y'all. Look. Oh, oh. The haters, get them out for you. To the office. The main office, where the principal is at. Okay, so you can get suspended. But also, we shouldn't criminalize lice. Go to the go to the nurse's office. Super lice becomes a bigger problem in Albuquerque. Super lice? Oh, girl, not these Marvel-built lice. Thinking about lice makes a lot of people downright itchy. And now some of those tough-to-get-rid-of bugs are more resistant than ever. So-called super lice. <laughs> huh? They're resistant to the typical over-the-counter medications. I had to handpick the lice out of her hair. Jennifer Gallegos tried for six hours to get rid of the lice in her daughter's hair. We had to disinfect the whole house, the cars, um, ourselves. Many of those over-the-counter products will kill the bugs themselves, but not the eggs. I... I'm so thankful that I've never had lice. Like, I, I mean, I've always had short hair when I was younger, but I couldn't imagine having this hair and lice. I would literally have to shave my hair off. Oh my God. Collins and her business partner use a gentle heat-based treatment, a lot like a hair dryer, to kill both the lice and their eggs. They say the treatment feels like a head massage and has been helping the clients that come through their doors. Girl, <laughs> girl. Girl said, no, not today. Full bonnet on, girl. Where you get that bonnet from? She said, it's 11.30 and the lights is jumping, jumping. As kids start the new school year, Collins predicts the problem will get worse. No. See, no. Timmy, eat your food. We got two chapters to get through. Because you thought I was finna send my child to school when all y'all run around with lice. No! Hell no. Huh. No, ma'am. How to get rid of head lice quickly and without chemicals. Girl, it's kind of sound like you need the chemicals. Lice 911. <laughs> Girl, what is that? I'm out of here. Worst lice, bad lice, and nasty lice removal. <laughs> no, no, no. Now, you didn't piss me off. Ew. They're moving the way that they were moving around. <sighs> Lord, I need a break. Sit still. Yeah! Sit, st sit yeah! still. Head lice are wingless insects spending their entire life on a human scalp and feeding exclusively on human blood. Guys, what do you think? Yeah. Oh my God, that is gross. Mama, 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 you don't feel that? You better talk to her before I do, because I'm hurt of feelings. That is disgusting. I will be confiscating those. Does this make you itch? Girl, I'm out. No, because they playing with my feelings. And a very, very calm day into this. Let me get out of here. Worst case of head lice infection crawling thousands of lice in hair and body? Oh, oh my God, I feel so bad. That is nasty. <laughs> That's a lot, y'all. And it's all in the clothes on the body. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Oh. Then I burnt the main clothes off. <laughs> I mean, hey, I would do the same thing, to be honest. Listen, I don't know what they about to do to that man, but hopefully, hopefully they just give him a, a little shower. Guys, lice and knits in African-American hair. How to remove lice from a big, beautiful afro. Ah! everyone, Celia Lice Lady here. Thanks for joining us today. Look, go ahead and click that button to subscribe for more Lice <laughs> videos. So today we're gonna show you how to do a treatment on textured hair. So let's just get right into it. So when you have hair this thick, it tends to get tangled. That's probably the biggest challenge. You have to take smaller sections to make sure that you can get all the eggs out, that the eggs don't get stuck. 
nice, great that she is being careful of the fact that this is textured hair and she doesn't want to ruin this girl pattern. She doesn't want to hurt the girl. She wants to use the right comb. She wants to be accommodating, but... Where's your bonnet, ma'am? Donde esta tu protección? I don't understand. Where's your protection, ma'am? Right now, we're just trying to find a bug. I'm not seeing anything. I don't know. She says she's not seeing nothing. Just putting some conditioner in her hair because textured hair like this is so hard to get that knit comb through. So this is going to give that glide. But this is going to take forever. This girl has a lot of hair. On a scale of one to ten, how bad was this this case? Not too. What the hell are we gonna do now? She got the lice. I got it, yes, baby. We love our Glop and Glam products, so things like the Creamsicle Mist Detangler, and we also use conditioner. That sounds good. That Glop and Glam, that first one, girl. Let me go ahead and check this out. I know I don't know if it's for lice or not, but that sounds good. Hold on. This is crazy. Shout out to people like this, the, the lice lady. You guys can go check out her content if you're dealing with lice. She seems pretty sensitive to the fact that it's like natural hair. Also, this is great because people don't think they can get lice if they have black hair. They just don't think they can get it. But listen, don't be trying on nobody's hats. Don't be sleeping on nobody's pillows. See, look at this comment. Lord, black people can get lice too. Thanks. <laughs> Faint. She fainted, y'all. Are you under the belief that Afro-textured hair can't get head lice? Or do you think lice prefer straight hair? Oh! Well, you may not be uh -uh. all that long. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> what a damn... I was not expecting that. Head lice, or head louse, is a tiny parasite that can quickly infest the scalp and hair of a human host. They start out as eggs attached to your hair strands called nits. After six to seven days, they hatch. By day 17, they grow to full adulthood ready to reproduce. So a few can quickly become an infestation of many. <laughs> <laughs> Those of us with kinky hair are dramatically less likely to contract head lice. In fact, it's been found that only 0.3% of African-American children get head lice. Interesting. Very interesting. I'm, I'm going to do a bit more research and anything that I find, I'm going to probably, I'm going to link it down below because it'd be nice to understand what lice is, who can get it, why people don't get it, why people do get it. But let's go ahead and end this video with a banger. Hello. Don't shake, don't shake my hand. My name is Dr. Daniel and unfortunately... Um, I do believe you did get the phone call. Yeah, we will remove each and every single egg and little lice that we find. Lice is nothing to be ashamed of. They actually enjoy clean hair. Potteratelco. So just parting your hair. Great. So let me just grab a towel here. Okay. Now go ahead and close your eyes. I'll just wipe that off for you. You can't do it! I can't. I'm gonna you are stressing me to hell. I'm not done. I'm done. <laughs> That's enough for today. I'm gonna leave some tips on how to prevent and to take care of lice. Not take care of them, but you know, get rid of them. Maybe I'll link a few articles or how to's or whatever. But I'm gonna go and um, lock my hair up in a steel box. Not one thing is touching this scalp, not today. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, go ahead and give it a big old thumbs up. If you wanna stick around, be my friend, be my homie, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and my second YouTube channel, Will on a Win More. I'm, I'm so thankful that this video is over. <laughs> but I do hope to see you all back here real soon for another episode of Will on a Win, but until then, bye.